Babies born prematurely often face a real struggle to survive. But scientists at Northumbria University believe breast milk, which was always known to be high in nutrients, could also contain something which could help severely ill babies beat the odds. They think viruses in breast milk eat harmful bacteria. A support from our news correspondent, Mark Denton. Here it goes. Charlie's favourite game, playing doctors. He's four now and full of beans, but he was born nine weeks prematurely. It was touch and go. To see your baby and he's just covered in wires in, in an incubator, um, you can't just go and hold him and he's just fight, fighting for his life really, it's, it's really hard. We, we said goodbye to him and just half expected ne never to see him again. Like Charlie, around 40% are premature. Babies develop either serious bowel disease or a blood infection. Of course, modern medical skill helped Charlie survive, but he could also have been helped by something in his mother's milk. This is a phage. It may look like an alien. Actually, it's one of the good guys because it eats bad bacteria. When a phage encounters bacteria, it latches on and injects its own DNA inside the cell where it reproduces. The new phages then burst through the cell wall and repeat the cycle until the infection is beaten. Scientists at Northumbria University and the Great North Children's Hospital think phages could be in breast milk and their immune boosting properties particularly benefit premature babies. When we're looking after babies that are born very early, some of them develop this devastating bowel disease and we think that that's associated with the particular patterns of bacteria that babies carry and that some patterns allow babies to stay healthy and other patterns allow babies to become unwell. And different phages could protect different premature babies because there are plenty to choose from. 10 million trillion trillion of them. That's more than all the other organisms in the world put together. Uh, this is a, a, a study that's been funded uh, by the Children's Charity Action Medical Research and it's allowing us to, to take look at the, the, the phage that are contained in, in over 100 breast milk samples from a neonatal biobank here at, here at the RVI. It's amazing. I, I, it's really hard to get your head around the fact that a virus, you, you know, could help, could have helped him. Uh, um, yeah, it's just amazing. Mark Denton, BBC Look North.